What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 10 for my playthrough on Pokemon Legend Arceus for the Nintendo Switch. So guys, in the last episode, we completed the Mount Coronet Highlands, defeated our fourth noble Pokemon, and in today's video, we're going to be heading to our fifth and final area, the Alabaster Icelands. You guys already know the deal. If you do enjoy the content at any time, make sure you support me as a content creator by leaving a like on today's video, and if you're not subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button join the community we've got plenty of content coming along the way so again if you are enjoying the content scroll down a little bit click that big red subscribe button it really does go a long way but like i said we're heading to the fifth and final area which is the alabaster icelands and i absolutely love this area i think it is my favorite in the whole game there's just so much to explore it is a big big area and a lot of cool pokemon in here so cannot wait to get in there and showcase it all for you guys but we're talking to leventon we're talking to akari over here they're like yo head over to this area and you gotta defeat avalon the final noble pokemon good old avalon and avalon's sick really really cool pokemon actually i should say his suing an avalon because it has a form in this game that is not normal and i believe it's a uh, fighting and something else i think all the hisuian forms or at least most of them are fighting you got the sneezler who's fighting the earth ring i think it's fighting uh and there's one other one that's a fighting type lilligan lilligan is now fighting type. It's really really cool but i love all the what's called all the hisuian forms i think they're really really dope but before we can actually head to the ice lands a car is like ao jeans Let's battle it up. So I'm like, all right, yo, run it up. You got three Pokemon. And I think she has like a Pikachu, a Togepi, and something else. Like, they should have made these harder. And a Mr. Mime. And Mr. Mime's hilarious. He, dude, he cracks me up every time I verse it. Every time I verse it, it absolutely cracks me up. Like, look at it. Just like, slowly put his hands on the wall. It's, dude, it's too funny. But we can go for an Agile. Actually, we'll just go for a Strong Shot and probably KO this thing. Mr. Mime, get out of my face. We gotta learn a better move. Maybe I should check my moves when we get to the Ice Lands. Maybe I learned like Shadow Ball or something cool. But Hex, it will do enough damage, Mr. Mime. Get on out, my game. Get on out of here. But, dude, I absolutely love how Typhlosion looks. Looks so tough. She throws out a Star Arabia. Well, 46. You know, oh, that thing. And Braver coming in hot. Hey! Hey! God dang. Recoil damage chipping her up. And they're probably going to get two moves. And she's going to be able to roost here, too. A lovely little roost. And I do have rollout. You know what? I could go for a strong style rollout. Or I'm going to go for an agile. Let's see how much damage this can do. Let's see how much damage an agile shot can do here. Rollout. Boop. Oh, stop. Wait, what? Wait, huh? Oh, it's part normal typing. Okay, I totally forgot. It's part normal typing. I thought it would be super effective. Thought it would be super effective. You know, we'll go for a flamethrower. Typhlosion is going to go down here, but we can throw out a Pokemon such as like our Hisui. Oh, no. Or he just or he just dumps on Staravia like that. Typhlosion. Jeez, man. But yeah, dude, I was like, I was like, okay, we got rollout. Going to be super effective on that bird. Of course, it's not. I think it's part normal type. He's going to drop a little agile style. He's going to take me out with a T-Bolt. Goodbye, Top version. It's all good. Rest easy. But, yo. Look at this painting over there. Ponita. Hold up, yo. Look at that painting over there. We're going to throw out... Uh, who's lowest level? We could throw out Sligu here. Yeah, we'll throw out Sligu. Little Hisuian Sligu. But before we actually, like, confirm our move here... Look at this painting right here. Ponita, baby. Este el Ponita. I love Ponita. <laughs> Ponita's just so sick. Such a cool Pokemon. I definitely want to shiny hunt a shiny uh, Ponita, which we will probably doing uh, be doing over on my live streams. So if you guys are interested, name is right on the layout, Jeans25 on Twitch, and link is down in the description below. Go hit that follow button, turn on notifications so you know when your boy goes live. We stream five plus days every single week. I'd love to see you guys pop out there. Come hang out with me. But there it is. A battle decided. Mwah. Lovely. Lovely. Akari, get out of my face. Can you heal my Pokemon at least? So I don't have to waste my time. Look at all that XP. Lovely XP. So we Voltorb goes to 44. We have Basky Legion who's level 52. And we can't really just be like using Basky Legion because then it'll be over leveled by everybody. Like he would just like completely get after it all there. But we're done with this. Oh, look at all these uh these swarms right here. We got Quillfish Swarm. That's pretty tough. The mass outbreaks. But they're good for shiny on. But we're gonna head to the Ice Lands. Let's go to a brand new area. And we should be able to get a new rideable Pokemon if we go long enough in today's video. Because it does take a little bit to get there. So hopefully we can get the final ride of the Pokemon, which is Braviary, the coolest one I have. You can fly, traverse lands. Oh my god, it's so good. It is so good. Cannot wait to get that Pokemon and just fly across lands for you guys. But look at this area. Like I said, one of my favorite areas in this game. It's just so, so cool. It's very open. It's very calm. It's very peaceful, too. That, that's how I would actually like have to like you know name it. But there we go. Hello, Levitin. He's like, hey, these are the ice lands. Go head over there. But yeah, it is chilly here. But put on a coat or something. Put on an extra lab coat. But before we actually head there, you guys know, I gotta be crafting some Pokeballs. Gotta be putting some items away. We gotta make sure we have a bunch of spaces. And who's here? Arita's here. Brisk out here. What's up, Arita? My girl. My girl and Adamant. What up, dude? What's she doing? What's she doing this for? Like, isn't it cold out? We're sitting in the snow. We're sitting in the snow. 
the lovely snow. Do -do -do -do. All right, you're not gonna offer your talking. Let me go. Let me go explore lands because there are a lot of brand new Pokemon in this area. Like I feel like when I when I first explored this area in my other playthrough, I what's it called? I thought that this area had the most new Pokemon. Like obviously when you go to a new area, there's gonna be new Pokemon, but this one just feels like it had so much more. But it's probably because the land's bigger than all. Because if I look at the map, look at this, yo. So much land to just go around on. You got lakes. You got caves in here. You got ice lands. Like, dude, it's amazing. And you got ice caverns, which is really, really cool. Let's put some miners away. And I think I already did it. I think I already put my shards away, did I? Yeah, we already put our shards away and everything from our last time we did this time distortion. So let's go here. Let's craft up some Pokeballs because you know we're going to need them. We craft 21 of those. And we have 22 of those, so we're thriving with that. We really do not. We were fine on revives. I mean, we're fine on potions. Okay, right, we're cool. We're ready to roll out here. Let's get after it. Let's get after it and look at that. Already a brand new Pokemon. Come here, boy. Snow Runt, baby. Absolutely love me a good old Snow Runt. Let me actually get this right here while I try to catch this Pokemon. Hopefully you don't see me, Snow Runt. I know you see that. Yeah, Snow Runt. What's goody, dude? Eat that. Sir, bop. Hit him with a Pokeball. Let's see if we can get a catch there. Nice first time catching the Icelands. No, you buttery biscuit. All right, you know, you'll be free. We'll see plenty more of those guys. We will see plenty more. Let's head down to our pathway here. So, we got to make our way all the way over to here, which is like the middle area. It's not too far. If you just kind of like traverse the path, you should be fine with it. You could honestly just climb that with Sneasler, but it is more fun. To Ooh. Oh, I had my Pokemon out, dude. I had my Pokemon out. What is going on? Snow going to run. You know, we're going to run. Because I'm not going to waste my time battling a Snow Run. Because I, I, I'm telling you guys, you will see a ton of them. You will see tons of Snow Runs. So, don't even worry. Don't even worry about it. There's an Apom. I do love to catch me some Apom. So, come here, Apom. Apom, where you going, girl? Come here. Yo, back shot. We out of here. Should be able to catch that, right? Oh, my God. Dude, we can't catch anything. Another snow run here today. Move Apom. We got to catch this lovely snow run. Luckily, the Apoms do not attack me. Hello, snow run. We don't catch you, dude. Yeah, make your way to, towards the Orenberry. Yeet. Bop. Get out of my face. And we got these new little items over here. Should we throw a Pokemon over towards that snow pile? Oh, sweet. We caught the snow run. We get snowballs. Snowballs. And you get some balls of mud in there. So it's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Hop back on the horse. And let's get a groove on. And like I said, a lot of icy caverns over here in caves. It's really cool. I absolutely love it. And I believe there should be a new Pokemon here as well. And yep, there he is. Little Bergmite. Little Bergmite over there. Toss an orange berry for him. Get in our sneak mode. Dang, I thought I could toss it behind him. We got two Bergmites. Really, really cool. Evolves an Avalug. I do not know how to evolve Bergmite into Hisuian Avalug. I'm actually going to throw Pokeballs at both these guys. Hopefully, we catch them. Stay in there. Yes, okay. There we go. Caught one. And the other one pops out. It's all good. We only wanted one. We only needed one. Let's get a move on. I believe we're going the right way. Yeah, we're just going to traverse through this little cavern here. And make our way towards the place. Let me hop off my horse. Hopping off my horse, even though it's a deer. <laughs> even though it's a deer. And once we get out here, we make our way to... This is a really cool scene right here. Just like a vast, open ice area, which I absolutely love. I believe there should be a new Pokemon chilling over here. A few, actually. Let's see. There's another Stone Rump. We just caught one. I could KO it for a Pokedex, which could be good. But I'm going to head up here first. And this is the area that we came in at. Towards this way? Actually, no, it's not. No, it's not. And this, 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 is the, this is the little scene I was talking about. Look at this. It's gorgeous. You got a waterfall. You got all the ice open. Oh, my God. Can't go wrong with it. Can't go wrong with it. And I'm actually going to kill this Snow Run here. Get that torch by Pokedex. Come here, Snow Run. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, dude. Let's go. Run it up. Run up. Snow Run's so cool. I, lo I love how he evolves in Frost Lights or Glalie. I really like it all around. And luckily, we have Typhlosion as our starter. This guy's going to rip through his ice. A lot of ice Pokemon here, so we can kind of just farm XP all that. Cause he's going to drop some Grit Dust for us, which we love. We love ourselves some good old Grit Dust. We'll take that, and there's newbie yo. Two newbies, Pillow Swine and Swine Up. And we want both of them. Look at them all just... Just chilling there. <laughs> they're so cool. They're so cool. I haven't seen an alpha uh, mammoth swine yet. Oh, I'm guessing they're in the game, right? They gotta be in the game. Right, let's throw berry to you. And berry to you. Let me pull out my great balls for you. Pull out my great ball for you. Hit that. Hit you. And I'm gonna hit you. Oh, he's going for this one. Oh, double swine up action. There you go. Catch that swine up. This pillow swine sees us. We already called a swine up. We catch another one? We do. We catch two. And we're going to go for this one now. Uh, let me guess. You like honey, yo. Everybody, yo. Chill on me. Chill on me. 
E E E E E E E. We're hitting you with a back shot. Oh, it wasn't even a back shot. Chill on me, pillow swines. Catch that, please. God dang it. Can I hit that one? Son of a bitch. You know, we'll do this the old fashioned way. Run it up. Run it up, because I need you in my Pokedex, pillow swine. God dang, yo. We're out here feeding a bunch of them. We're feeding a bunch of them, and they don't want to stay in the great balls. So we'll hex it up, chip up some damage, and we could probably hit it again. Oh, oh ouch. Oh, hey. Chill on me, pillow swine. Dude just ripped into me. And we can go into Voltorb here. I do like me some Voltorb. Good old Voltorb back here. And we're just going to throw in a, what's called, actually, why did we go into Voltorb? Actually, what's called would probably be neutral, right? Ground moves would be neutral him because he is grass. So I do dig it. I do dig it. But we're going to catch here anyway. Let's go. Big old pillow swine. Add it to the decks, baby. And I got to heal up my Typhlosion. I got to heal up my Typhlosion. Come here, Typhlosion. Can you hop off? There we go. Where's my Typhlosion? You my revives. Here you go, buddy. I think high horsepower doing me dirty. High horsepower doing me dirty. And we should have some super potions located here. Yes, sir. Now your boy's always staying up to date on the crafting materials. Gotta always keep it going. And I do not want to battle you. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. Back on the horse. And there is a lovely Baneri over here. Even though we have Baneri, I would love to catch another one. Baneri, come here. Come here, little bunny. Come here, little girl. Uh, I don't care if we catch it or not. We're just gonna keep rolling. But I just want to hit it with the Pokeball. No, just get that. Just get the poison. And everything. There it is. Caught. Caught it. Why is it picture? It's picture in the top of the corner. It was cool. Oh, oh, oh. Hold up. Two of them. Okay, these aren't alpha. I know you guys are probably liking Chester Berries. I'm trying to eat that over his head. Where's my great balls? We're definitely going to need great ball for this dude. Catch that one, please. Catch it. Shoot. Yo, that girl, he's got to chill on me. Shoot. Ah! You know what? You're both dead. We're killing both of you. Come here. 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 Run it. Run it. We'll take the XP. There's another Glalie down there that we'll catch. 56. God dang! Hey! Chill on me. Not very effective. That's fine. We'll fight you. I'm just going to go for a strong style. Strong style flamethrower. Should be able to take it out. It's 56, though. I don't even know. Come on. Take it out. Dump on this thing. Please. Get it out of my face. Let's go, yo. I feel like this is a great spot to farm XP. With Typhlosion, everybody can get some mean XP. Look at that XP. Oh, you want the smoke now? You want it too? Look at it, yo. We'll take the XP all day in this area. All day in this area. He's gonna oh, that might kill me. It does kill me. That is whack. Get out of my face, yo. Poor Typhlosion getting peace up today. I don't want to run from him. I kind of want to kill this thing. We have no super effective moves. We do have Stone Axe. Lovely. Lovely stone axe. And what type of this thing might just be solid ice. I think it's solid ice here. And I think it's strong style. Strong style stone axe should be able to just dump on this thing. Cleaver's physical attack stat is through the roof. My man. All day. And he, and he lands crazy. Uh, even though I don't think we need it. We're gonna, like us. We're gonna go for his catch up here. Let me, oh, there's an alpha clay. Look at that thing. I think it's a menace. Look at it. Standing there. Menacingly. <laughs> We're gonna heal up Typhlosion again. I don't think we should have him in the front lines here. I'm gonna have like somebody else in the front lines. But we're gonna catch this, uh. We're gonna catch this dog right here. And I feel like he's a citrus berry kind of guy, you know? Everybody likes citrus berries. Look at this one, yo. Know, just staring at me. Yo, yeah, like, look the other way. This guy, yo, this dude's big. He big, yeah. Look the other way. Hey, hey. What did I say? I said the other way. I know you see that berry. Oh. We're catching them old-fashioned way. Run it up, Glalie. Run it up! I, I want this thing in my Pokedex, so I'm gonna catch this old-fashioned way. And he looks so sick. I feel like I feel like he does need a third evolution. Like he's big. I feel like he needs a third evolution, you know what I'm saying? Oh, we gotta do moves for the Pokemon. We gotta do moves for the Pokies, yo. My Pokemon needs some moves. Definitely needs some moves in a while. We're taking some damage. I'm gonna go for the catch now. We're gonna see if we get we have any luck in our hand, yo. Give me some luck here. Give me some ye old jeans luck for the YouTube channel. For the YouTube channel. Give it to me. For the YouTube channel, baby. All day long. All day long. Let me actually change up these moves right here. Let me change up the moves for the squad. I feel like a lot of them are higher level and we haven't checked their moves in a while. Let's see if we have anything new. Swift, Flame Wheel, Dare Shadow Ball, baby. Give me Shadow Ball. And we could learn Overheat. I'm going to get rid of Overheat. For that. Oh, yo, wait, wait a minute. What's this? Infernal Parade. These are attacks with a... Uh, 
Moderate fireballs that may also leave target with burn. The move power is doubled if the target has. I kind of want to learn this move. No, we are going to learn this move. Yes, sir. If we have a sash condition on us, it's double damage. Overheat could be our big stab damage. And Shadow Ball could be our, our, our great ridiculous move. So look at that move set, dude. Run it up. Run it up all day. Three new moves for him. Let's check out Cleaver. Cleaver's got to be able to learn X Scissor, right? Air Slash, Swords and X Scissor, baby. And the moveset I really like to run with this guy is this right here. And then Sword Stance changes this. Look at that moveset. Look at that moveset. Cannot go wrong with it. You can set up your Sword Stance. You have two stab moves with Rock and Bug type, and then you have a great, great coverage move with Fighting. Considering we have no Fighting Pokemon on the squad. It's beautiful. Basket Legion. Haven't really played around with this move. Let's see what he's rocking with. He is Ghost Typing, so... I mean, is he Physical Attacking, though? I do want to give him Shadow Ball. Probably over Crunch. Actually, over a Double Edge. Give it a Double Edge. Right? Knock it down. Knock it down. He, he needs to learn some more moves. I, th I feel like he can learn a better water move, you know? But there we go. Do that. And Star Arabia. No, we ain't touching you. And you, you probably don't really learn too much here. Iron Head? We do want Iron Head. You are Iron Pokemon. Let's get rid of Acid Armor. Confirm that. You are a lovely little Steel type. And then last but not least, I'm, I think I'm just going to keep the moves with my boy right here. He's got some great moves. Let's see what, he's, what else he's cooking with. Nah, yo, his moves are lovely. His moves are lovely. So we're going to do that. And then I think I. No, I do not need to revive anybody. Need to hand out free potions. Potion for you. And a potion for Cleaver. Alright, let's roll out. Let's roll out. Keep continuing on with this Iceland. Yo, we got some rocking moves now. I definitely want to see a six new move. Definitely want to see a six new move. But we're gonna keep moving this way. See a nice lovely snow run. We'll take this, because you know we are the best. And we're gonna see if there's any new Pokemon lurking around here. Any newbies. There's a Bergmite. I, I, I would like to catch Bergmite. Cool little Pokey. Where's Bergmite? Catch it. Off the bounce, I think it was. Another Glalie. That's dope. And we'll take Bergmite. There we go. Another catch. And look at the top left corner. Why is there, like, a little picture, like, messed up sometimes? Oh, where do we got to go? Right over there. So, you know, I'm going to catch Snow Run because, you know, Snow Run's giving me a tough time earlier. So, we'll catch him all day. We'll hop back up on the horse. And we'll get moving towards the main mission. Oh, it's right here, too. Oh, a bunch of them. Bunch of them. Hello, Bergmite. Bergmite, how you doing, kind sir? Take this. And we'll get rocking over to a dude right here. And continuing on with the main mission. So, I kind of just went right up to the main mission. But I definitely want to backtrack later in today's video. And just explore this area a little bit more. Because there's a lot of different things that we can do. Well, one thing that we have to do is actually get the bird. And I feel like that's like my main mission for today's video. Is get the bird and then we can mess around and do other things on the side. Like catch new Pokemon and traverse this area a little bit more. And with the bird, you can actually traverse it a lot. I feel like the, using the bird and Sneasel are your top two main things to do uh, with this. But it actually, it, there's actually a really cool mission here. Which I really, really like. Hopefully, we get to do it. So, let's get rolling here. He's talking about a colossal Pokemon. Blah, 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 and I think he shows us the bird. I think he's like, hey, yo, go get the bird. How you doing? Kind sir. Let's see what he does. Oh, he wants to fight me. Oh, he wants to fight me with my Typhlosion? With his new moves? With his new moves? Yo, I can over... Oh, he has two. You son of a biscuit. You have Frost Ice and it clearly? Don't use it. Oh, my God. It's Rocket Punch. What do you want me to do? Kidding me. Give me, give me Cleaver. Give me Cleaver out here. Are you kidding me, man? Get out my face. Get out my face. I'm not dealing with you. Ross Lance looking around. And you know what? I can do this. Just go into a nice, lovely Stone Axe. We can't get two turns here. So we'll take you out with Stone Axe. Thank you, Cleaver. Oh, of course this thing's on one, but at least we'll take Splinter Damage. In a bit. He's going to go for a Hex. We'll soak that up all day. No, I'm only at half health. And cool. We can actually go for... Let me switch to you. Go for a Stone Axe here. We'll take you out, and we'll have a uh, splinter damage take out that early after tier. Even though Cleaver's probably gonna go down here. That's a crash. Hey, you chill on me. We down. We down, but splinter damage gonna chip away. We'll take that XP all day. Get out of my face and heal up my Pokemon, please. Because nothing's worse than when you're out in a brand new area and you defeat a battle and some of your Pokemon die and they don't heal. Because then you have to go all the way back and come all the way back again. I don't feel like using revives and stuff. There we go. We take him out. We'll take the XP. He says, Outstanding. You defeated me. Of course I did. I'm the best. I'm the best, baby. I'm the best. Where's my bird at? Really want the bird, yo. Braviary is such a cool thing for this game. Really, really cool. Just give it to me. I hate how it's the last area, but it makes sense that it's the last area. It's so, like, it's not like, I wouldn't say it's like, you can't say it's OP because it doesn't give you any, like, competitive advantage, but it's so OP at traversing the land. So once you get it, it makes going back to all the different areas way better. And there it is, yo. Braviary! Look how sick he looks. I definitely want him on my team for that last spot, though. We can catch him in this area, so maybe we'll get him today. Maybe we'll get a nice little ruffle today. 
Level 50 40 bombs. I have to make my way up there to talk to her. And of course my Pokemon are there. Can I fly back here? I cannot. What the, oh my God, get out of my face. You know, let's switch to this. You know, I'm a material guy. We gotta use Sneasler here. Where's Sneasler? Give me my Sneasler. Can you hop up here, Sneasler? You can't climb this? I have to do this the old fashioned way? Are you kidding me, Sneasler? You couldn't climb up that ice? You can climb up like pretty much everything. We're gonna go over here talk to, is this Sabby, right? Is that her name? Hello. How you doing with mommy? Look at that, Bravey. Oh, he's looking so tough. He looks so tough. But before we actually get him, we have to go through like a bunch of different training phases. Or not even training phases. It's like, okay, come see Bravey Ari up here. And she's going to send us to like the top of a mountain. You guys will see in a second. Look at him. She just hops on him. She's out of here. You're like, gone. Look at that. You hear a fly animation. They should have made an animation of just Bravey Ari taking off with her on her back. Would have been really cool. Would have been really cool. But look at that. Catch up to Sabby. And where's she at? She's somewhere weird. Look at that. All the way over there. Are you kidding me? Would it be faster or faster for me? Oh, I just took ball damage. I was gonna say, would it be faster for me to just like fast travel over there? I could, you know, just do this. I kind of want to. Actually, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna heal heal up here. And actually, where do I have to go? Oh, I have to go right here. So it's yeah, it's definitely easier for us to fast travel here. And rest, heal up our Pokemon, and then climb the mountains with Sneasler. You know, Sneasler's where it's at. Sneasler is great here. You guys have seen the second, ready? I'll show you guys Sneasler. Sneasler's the best because we gotta get up on the mountains anyway, so might as well bring out the Sneezy. Sneasler, baby! I feel like Sneasler is so much better in this area than it was in the last area where you were supposed to actually use that. Which I think is funny because, dude, it's just all mountain ranges here. So I just use Sneasler and I climb up to the top of them. Like, look at this! <laughs> look at that, just clawing, gripping up. No problem whatsoever. No problem whatsoever. And if you look down here, there should be a Crobat flying around. Yeah, see, there's the Crobat right there. He's just chilling there. If you guys want to catch a Crobat, you can snipe him with some feather balls. Kind of go from there. It's pretty cool. We'll bring out our deer, and there's the Braviari. There's my girl. And actually, there's some snow here. I want some snow. Give me some snowballs. Good for catching Pokemon. Messing around with them. And here's Savvy. Hi, Savvy. Look at Braviari, dude. He looks sick, yo. He's so tough. Definitely one of the cooler Hisuian forms in this game. I feel like they all the Hisuian forms and all the new Pokemon in this game are absolute bangers. I don't think they messed up on one. I really don't think they did. I think they all look sick. I couldn't name, like, a worse one. But the best ones? I had a few in mind. I think Braviari is definitely up there. I think Cleaver and Basculus are sick too. I don't think Hisuian and Electrode and Voltorb is like the coolest, but I think it's really cool. I think it is really cool though. But just because it's electric and grass type, come on. Yeah, I think it's the only one, right? So now we need to catch up to her again. She's all the way over there. Can we fast travel anywhere? We cannot. We cannot. So you know what? We're going to have to take the old fashioned way, the good old deer route. And before we do that, you guys know I'm a fan of the materials. Let's get moving here. I cannot jump here. Oh my lord. Go ahead, deer. Go to E, ouch. <laughs> oh, and there's a wisp. I'll take this wisp all day. You know, I'm a wisp guy. And there's a chokes over here. We can actually traverse towards this land and kind of go here and catch some new Pokemon before we head to the top of that cliff. Look at it. All the way over there. God dang. God dang. And yo, Electabuzz. Electabuzz, come here. I don't think I have you in the decks in this game. We got a dust stone. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. So, yo, yo, I know you don't see me. I know you don't see me. And I know you're a big fan of cherry berries. Everybody loves a good old cherry berry. Yeah, everybody loves good old cherry berry. Eat up, eat up. Munch, munch, munch. Back shot. Got my face. And I'll take this. There's another one over there if we don't catch this one. But heck, we catch this one. Let's go. Ambi Palm, how you doing? How you doing, Ambi? How you doing, girl? And then I saw a Machoke over here, which I kind of want. I don't know if I have a Machoke yet. Hello, Machoke. Machoke is definitely, definitely likes to get his gains in, so Hoppa Berries are great for the gains. Great for the gains. Give him that. Yeah, yo, Apom, chill on me. I'm trying to catch Swole Ski McGee over here. Eat up. Hit that thing with a back shot. Dude, back shots are words. At me, B. Give me that. Let's go, Machoke. That's our second one we call it. Okay, that's cool. And there's another one. Hey, how you doing, dude? I'm not going to catch you, though. Not going to catch you. Alpha Pillow Swine. And which way should we go? Because we have to go all the way there. And I can honestly just like, ride my deer over there. But I want to kind of traverse through these lands to catch a few new Pokemon. Well, we got some time. Another swine up. We caught a pillow swine. Ooh, a bomb of snow. We haven't seen a snow. <gasps> An AB palm. Two AB palms. Big fan of the AB palms. How you doing, ABs? We catch you. Thank you. We catch you. I missed them. God dang it. Oh, we caught that one. Catch you. And I want to catch this bomb of snow. Where'd he go? Hopefully this thing doesn't hit me. 
What's, what's my items? Okay. Oh, it sees me. That thing doesn't see me. Oh, he, does he? No, the AV bomb sees me. Can we catch that? Catch that bomb of snow. Yes, sir. A bomb of snow catching him. Dope, dope, dope. Let's keep moving down the land. There should be a few new Pokemon. Oh, Dust Cops. We did already catch a Dust Cops, but I kind of want to catch it again. Okay, I can just KO this thing and, show, and showcase a new move. Let's do it. Let's fight this thing. Come here, Dust Cops. Run it up, dude, because we caught one in the, uh, what was it? The Cabal Coastlands. We had to catch one for the mission. I can actually use my new moves. We already have strong style unlock for it. I just want to see how this looks. I really do just want to see how this looks. I think it's his signature move. Let's see it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. It's like Will-O-Wisp on steroids. Like, usually Will-O-Wisp is just like the little flame that circles around him. But then, oh, yo, there's a Blissey. Back to what I was saying. Well, it's kind of uses like it's just like a flame that circles around them and burns. This one throws out like three flames and just murks on them. Let's see, you're definitely a honey kind of gal. Yeah, where's my honey at? Where's my great balls. Do I have leaden balls? I don't know if I do. Turn around, girl. Oh, there's an Eevee here, too. There's an Eevee here, too. I really want to catch that Eevee. Can we catch that Blizzy? I know you don't see me. Yes, sir, okay. We gotta, we gotta keep quiet here. Where's that? Where's the honey at again? Yo, chill on me, girl. Where's my great balls at? I need my great balls. I need to catch this thing. This thing's pretty kind of rare Pokemon. Eat, eat, eat. It'll be on the rock again. I see you, Eevee. I definitely want to catch you, but Blissey's more important right now. Shoot, man. Now, let's try a different food. Let's try... Try some hardy greens. Oh. <laughs> she seems like she didn't want to eat it. Yo, oh, AB Palm, leave me alone. And of course she sees me now. You know, we're doing this old fashioned way. Come here. Let me tell you something. Run it up. We're doing this old fashioned way. Hopefully the AB Palm is not, it's just leave me alone. Let's keep it. No! No! Run away from me. Dude, we were hitting that thing with some good Pokeballs. I'm kind of upset we didn't catch that. Kind of upset. But there's Blissey if you guys want it. Nice little rare spawn over there. Some more AB Palms. Uh, what else can we do here? I'm kind of just lurking around here looking for new Pokemon. But we can head to that new area. There's a Dust Cops. We already took one out. We already caught one before. AB Palms chilling. Hi, AB Palms. Lots of dust cops around here. Lots and lots of dust cops. What is that? Another Glalie. Catching some nice Glalies. Uh, let's head towards that area. It's this way. Onward! Should be a pathway to kind of lead here. Or, I can just be a cool guy and do this. Yeah, I can just do this. Oh, give me this Viva Choke. Hello, Glalie. Sorry, we already caught one of you. I'm out of here. Let me climb. Climb, Sneezer, climb. Good old Sneezy, dude. Oh, we're going the wrong way. What am I doing? Oh, don't, don't let me die. I go this way. Ow, Sneasler. <laughs> Change the deal. We have to go this way, right? We can just line up our thing that way. There we go. All right, let's go back. Traverse back. Yo, I'm so upset we didn't catch that Blissey. That Blissey's a rare spawn. That Blissey would have been a nice catch. How you doing? A palms, AB palms. Look at this. Yo, we cooking right here. Another wisp that we're just going to skip. I'll get it in a little bit. I'll get it later today. I want to head towards my main mission. Sneezer climb. Look at that moon, yo. The moon's looking pretty. We can just... Hop back on our deer. Our weird deer. Oh, and there's... Oh, we gotta go down here. We have to for sure go down here. We have to for sure go down here. We have to for sure go down here. And what's down here? A nice little ice cap. We can catch a Pokemon at. Hello, Bird White. That. And, oh, mischievous. I don't even know if we have that. I really want that. Do not see me. You do not see me! Thank you. Was that another Bird White down there? I know you're plump being kind of... Oh, you know, you're getting it the old-fashioned way. You're getting it the old-fashioned way. What is that? Oh, <gasps> a soul! <gasps> beep, 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 Yo, a suing... Zoro. I do not have one of these. Backshot, come on, yo, catch it. This thing's so sick. Yes! He's so sick. If I didn't get a what's called on my team, a ghost type on my team, I would definitely take him. He's just so sick. I want to fight this dude old fashioned way. But yo, what a catch. We'll take that all day. We'll take that all day. All dang day. 
All day we will take that. He's suing Zoru, and then it's Zoru, it's Zoru, and then Zoruk. It's really really cool. We got some drift plans, but it is nighttime, so you know. We got it's just a bunch of drift plans of Pokemon. Oh, Perkly, and but a lot of Pokemon that we saw before. I don't think we called it Perkly, but I don't feel like going after that thing. What is that? Oh, Alpha Sneasler. Alpha Sneasler doing me there. What do we got here? Jeff Flumes. I'm out of here. Just want, just want the material. You guys know me. You guys know me. Just want the material. Let's roll out. Onward, jeans. There's some water here, which we can just, you know, do this. Oh, and there's a space-time distortion forming. Where at? Right here. We can actually go do that. If I wanted to. But maybe we'll do it in a little bit. I want to actually go up here and do the... Uh, do our main mission. And how do we get up there? How else would we get up there? It's Sneasler, baby. Sneasler. Yeah, we call some goodies today. Got some goodies today. This goes back to Sneasler. And we go gonna climb. We're gonna climb to the top of the mountain. Because you know we want Braviari. And I'm hoping after we do Braviari, that space time distortion could still be chilling there. Because if that's the case, we could be thriving. We could really be thriving. We can go there. Oh yo, there's Kadabra. Luckily we can walk up here. Kadabra's are kind of a pain to get. Oh, we hit it. Can we catch that? It's our one chance. Any Abras or something? Sweet, yo. Get a nice little Kadabra. Loving it. Bron yo, did we not catch a Bronzong last episode? If so, here's our chance. <gasps> Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Last Pokemon for the squad. Yo, hey! Yo, if this thing hits me, I'm gonna cry. Chill on me. Catch that one, please. Yes, yo. The last Pokemon we want for the squad. And we're going to have to kill this one because I don't feel like dealing with it. And I want to aim our Pokedex. The last Pokemon for the squad. We caught ourselves a rough with that will eventually evolve into Hisuian Braviary. Absolutely amazing. It will evolve at 54. Level 54, we can get that thing. Rough foot, get out of my face. And these rough foots are high level here. And they're pain. There's a distortion over there, which is really cool. I kind of just want to get up here, do this, and then ride my weird ear. Oh, there's more stuff here. More stuff we can do. We can ride our weird ear towards this mission right here and go get Braviar because we, we just have to kind of go up here. So this mission right here is actually really, really cool. I actually really enjoy it. I think it's a cool little puzzle. We have to head into this temple and figure out some puzzles and make our way towards the top. I really do like it. And there is an Alpha Gallade up at the top, which is super sick. Super, super sick. So I was like, blah, blah, blah. Meet me at the top. So once we meet at the top, we will get Braviar and then we'll be able to jump off, fly around, do some cool things, which I really enjoy. I really do enjoy like I said, Braviary is the best rideable Pokemon. Hands down. Hands down, it is the best rideable Pokemon. So we're going to head inside this cave. We got to make our way to the top. Make our way to the top. And I believe there's like some a few enemies here. Some Bronzongs, all that good stuff. We do need to craft some new Pokeballs. Some brand new Pokeballs. But as you guys can tell, this is obviously the Regigigas Temple. Yo, let me try to catch this thing. Let me throw a cannon over Barry. Oh, I know you see that. Yeah, eat up, eat up, eat up. Well, can we catch that? I don't think we caught a bronze song yet. We actually might have. I'm not sure. Yeah, yes, sir. We actually caught two before. I'll take it all day, though. We do not want that. So, see, making our way towards the top here. Golbat, how you doing? We do not want to go that way. We want to go this way, I believe. Hey! Hey! Leave me alone! Things freak me out. Chill on me. Use the moves on me. Get out of my face. All right, we gotta head this way. We gotta head straight up this temple. So what we have to do here, like I said, there's going to be puzzles here. And they're kind of simple once you kind of get to know them. But it does take a little bit of memorization. So if you guys have a terrible memory, write it down on a piece of paper. So what you want to do is follow these dudes. So that's a rock one right there. You can tell by the rock symbol. Rock. And then what's this one? This one is going to be steel. And this one is going to be ice. So we got rock, steel, ice. So every time the door is going to ask you, hey, yo, what's the pattern? This one's rock, steel, ice. And the pattern changes. So we want rock. Oh, I hit rock twice. Oh, no, no, never mind. We got we got to restart. It's rock, steel, ice. I hit rock twice because I was mashing, eh? Investigate. Three panels carved into the door. Which one do you want to press first? We want to press the rock panel. We want to press the steel panel. And then we want to press the ice panel. Bingo, bango, bongo. Bah. We did it. Open up the first door. There are three doors, I believe. And once you get through all the three doors, you should be able to get yourself a graveyard. At the top of the, at the, top of the temple. The top of the lovely temple so let's keep a move on here and what you want to do is kind of just look out for them and see where's the first one at because that kind of that kind of like distinguishes your orders where is the first uh panel at? where's the first little reggie statue that you can look at? so i'm gonna go here and we're gonna find out where the first reggie statue is usually the first reggie statues are farthest away from it so 
going to be this one. It is going to be this one. So this one's going to start off with ice. So we got to remember ice. Ice, rock. And usually wherever they're facing is where the next Reggie is. So it's ice, rock, to here. Steel. Ice, rock, steel over to this one. Because you know that one's looking at that one. So ice, rock, steel. Ice, rock, steel. Rock. Ice, rock, steel, rock. Ice, ice rock, steel, rock, ice. Got it. Ice. Rock, steel, rock, then ice. Did we do it? You press the panels? Yes, sir. Open the door so they get harder and harder. So this is the last one. This one, again, the puzzles are hard once you figure it out, but it's just like, dude, memorizing, memorizing like seven of them. Kind of a pain. Kind of a pain. So we're on the last one here. And where does it start at? I think it starts right here. Oh, it actually starts back here. It starts back here. Okay, let's get it. I might have to write this one down. This one's tough. This one's tough. All right, so we got steel, steel, ice, rock, steel, ice, rock, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, rock, ice, no, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, ice, rock, Ice, steel, rock. So it's steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, rock. I think I got it. It's gonna be tough. Steel, ice, rock, ice, steel, rock. Correct? Gene's memory good? Mwah, yo, three for three. Run it up. Run it up. Yo, I got a good memory. I always have, so. I do really good at those puzzles. Really good. Really, really good. Dope. Make your way to the top floor of the Snow Point Temple. Lovely. And like I said in the beginning, there should be an Alpha Gallade somewhere over here. Here's a roll, so that means Gallade should be close by. And oh, dude, this is move, but I really want this thing. If I hide around the corner, because I really want this Pokemon. Lovely little rolls. Beautiful. That was our first rolls catch. And yo, chill on me. Hey! Give me my deer. Where's my deer? I can't ride deer here. Hey! Yo, dude, this thing's like guarding the temple, yo. Oh. Hey! Hey! Leave me alone. Let me let me escape the temple. Because we can't catch him yet. There's no point of battle on that thing. Jeez, yo, that thing's storming at me. Another Rolts. Oh, that one sees me. I'm out of here. Out of here, Rolts. Actually, should we fight the Rolts? Nah, we chillin'. We chillin'. We are chillin'. But the puzzle's all done. All we gotta do is do the heel toe express and walk all the way to the top of the mountain. And talk to Sabby. Hi, Sabby. How you doing? How you doing, girl? How, how come you... How'd you get up? Oh, she flew at Bravey. I was going to say, how'd you get up here? And we had to solve all the puzzles. Super whack. Super, super whack. But there we go. She flies up there with Bravey. Definitely makes it a lot easier. Just give me the bird. Give me the bird. And the worst part here is... Just watch this. You guys will see in a second. You guys will see in a second. Oh, wait. We got a battle. Not even that. Not even that. And of course, we have a top version now. I totally forgot we have the map. <laughs> she has a Rhyperior. And a Mag Mortar. Hey, yo. I, wait, and what? Get on my face. Uh, do we have anything super effective about any of these guys? I think I'd rather go after like these little dudes first. You can go for a regular Shadow Ball here. Try to take this thing out here. It should be able to. Level 30? Come on, man. Get this thing out of my face. Oh. Oh, come on, Typhoid. You're better than that. You're better than that. We are done for. Agile style poison gas. You're coming hot. Drop me. Oh, my move does double damage now. My period's looking around. Oh, yes, sir. I have a status condition. We do double damage now. We do double damage. I'm going to, you know, switch my opponent to. I just right here. While we're doing double damage, we might as well hit up on the period, right? Double damage with status condition. Might as well switch to a strong style, right? Might as well switch to a strong style. Double the damage here. Get the stab boost. It, can we KO? How much damage are we doing? That's a big damage. That's a big damage on the right period. I'll take that poison all day. Oh! God dang, dude. I knew that was coming. I just didn't know when. <laughs> I just didn't know when. Uh, Let's switch to... Legend could be pretty good. 
I think Voltorb can do a lot of work. We got Cleavor. Good old Cleavor. Can I go wrong with Cleavor? Get him Cleavor. Um, should have close combat this thing. Try to drop it. My defense will drop down, but as long as we care, this thing should be fine. Let's go. Get that thing out of my face. Defense stats were lower. This thing's on one. This thing's kind of chilling. It's only like level 30, though. This thing's going to use a flamethrower, which... Eat up. Yeah. Dope. Dope, dope, dope. Uh, we'll go for... Actually, I'm going to switch to you. I hit this thing with Stone Axe. Get it, yo. Stone Axe is so good. Look at that move. Rips through. And then it has the splinter damage. That thing's going to go down. Then all we have to worry about is that thing. Then always going to come through here. We get a big dodge. A big old dodge. Splinter damage. going to say, Ayo, get out of my face. And then Magmortar, what are you going to do? Flamethrower, and we're dead. We are dead indeed. It's all good, though. It's all good. We're just going to bring out our lovely little... Uh, who's lowest level? Uh, let's go. Let's go my Voltorb here. Voltorb can just finish you off. Look at this. Lovely Voltorb. We need a Leaf Stone to actually evolve that thing. And we use Spark. Even though it's our worst move, it just looks kind of cool. It just looks kind of cool. So there's KO. Thank you very much. And we'll take all the XP. And that's one bad thing that I hate about this game. It's like when uh you don't get the XP until every single Pokemon's dead. So like, say I killed somebody with my Typhlosion. Say I killed five Pokemon with my Typhlosion. And the six Pokemon kills my Typhlosion. My Typhlosion gets no XP. So she doesn't heal up her Pokemon, which is super whack. But she's like, hey, meet me at the top of here, and I'll give you the lovely little bird. Look at this run, dude. We gotta go like 10 miles, dude. Look at this. Why couldn't we walk together? Why couldn't we walk together, Savvy? We'll do a little roll. This little stop, drop, and roll, and we'll leave the, leave the lovely palace of this temple. Give me, oh my god, yo, I love this thing. Give it to me. Give it to me. Rock, rock, it said. <laughs> it's so sick. And what, do, oh, I have to fight it now. Oh, I'll, I'll kill you, dude. I still have my Voltorb. And of course, we're throwing out this thing. I, we have to fight this thing. I totally forgot. Level 54. Uh, Basculage, you can do some work with a little bit of crunch action. It's psychic typing. Basculage Legion chipping. Chipping. This thing's going to switch to Agile style. He's going to whip me with something. Oh, he's going to roost. Oh, come on, man. Gonna have double roost. Oh, come on, man. What'd you mean? Double roost. Let me agile style here. Won't do anything. We'll just go for a normal crunch. Munch, munch. Do not agile style roost again. Cool. Defensive stats were lowered. And he's just gonna roost, and we should be able to just take him out here. That's pretty much what this Braviary does. He just, just sits here and roosts all day. We'll switch to strong style. My Basket Legion will just give it a nice little crunch. Later. Later, Braviary. And we'll take that XP to the house with us. We get a decent amount of XP just traveling up this up place. You catch a lot of Pokemon, you battle a decent amount. Basically, he's level 55, yo. This guy's going to carry us through the post game. Because <laughs> there's some big battles in the post game that we're definitely going to want. And we're definitely going to need Basically just to rip through it. But finally, after all that traversing through this land, she plays the flute that is full of pokies. Love it. And now you guys know that's a sign of us getting ready. This thing is lovely. It's absolutely amazing. Let me play a flute. Braviary. So cool. Cannot wait to ride it. Look at that Braviary looking at me. He's like, hey, dude, you got a flute too? He's like, you got one? Let me join the squad. Braviary, open his heart and learn well the sound of your playing. Yes, sir, there's my dude. Gives us the sky plate. Thank you very much. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. Thanks, Abby. Thank you very much. And my boy comes out here. This, this was the thing I said that's kind of annoying. We opened all those doors and did all the puzzles. And this guy just walks straight up like, oh, open doors. Blah, 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 blah. Just walks right up through them. No problem whatsoever. He talks about the rift. That is towards the end game, which we we're actually really close to doing. But he talks about that. But now we have Braveyard, which is amazing. And our first mission with Braveyard is to fly off. Kind of just, it's kind of just like, hey, yo, here's how you fly. You can do this. And we got to start heading towards Avalon, which is going to be the next end final noble pokemon that we're gonna face off in this game so it's pretty cool pretty cool so look at this right at the top of this temple we gotta go to avalug's legacy it is right down there I'm gonna head down there i love how it's snowing and like you can see it on the clothes you can now call him brave to glide through the air with yes sir teach us how to do it but it's pretty simple you just hit, you just hit b or y what I want to do is switch to my boy Braviary and use the plus button. And look at this. Yes, sir. We can hit B to glide faster. We can hit Y to dive down. It's really cool. It's really cool. I love it. I love it. Definitely, like I said, one of the coolest rideable Pokemon in this game. Look at this, dude. Dive down and glide fast at the same time. We play no games. This thing is so much fun to ride. Is that distortion still open? 
It's not. Oh, dang it, man. I really want to do it. I really want to do it in this area. There would have been a bunch of new cool Pokemon. What is that on the ground? A bunch of pillow swines. Oh, no. Did I miss it? Maybe I get up there. <laughs> and we'll do that. And we'll head towards this right here. And we'll investigate this ice thing. And we actually might have another battle here. Why do I feel like we have another battle? I'm my arc phone and my Pokemon are not healed up, which is kind of whack. And I, somebody comes here to talk to us. And I think we have to battle him. We got a piece of eternal ice. Let's see. Yeah, this guy. But we already battled him. Right? We battled him earlier. It's like, hey, you made it here. And now he's just going to make, hey, you got to go to the eternal ice. Put it in the thing. And then you can face off with Avalug. Avalug, like I said, last name with Pokemon. Which we're not going to be facing off in today's video. I feel like for the rest of the video, we're going to be collecting Pokemon and exploring this area a little bit more. I do need to craft some more Pokeballs. Let's see what this guy does. Till next time we meet. He's gone. Okay, make your way to the Ice Peak Arena. So, Ice Peak Arena is right here. And that is where we are going to first. But for now, you know, I'm just going to fly back here. And we're just going to make our way and collect some new Pokemon, collect some new items, and have some fun with this area. Because, you know, this area is where it's at. And we got to get some more levels. Because, you know, I feel like we're a little under level. We could definitely be using some. We're gonna go here, we're gonna craft some Pokeballs, and we're gonna go catch some things. We're gonna try to catch that Blissey again. No, it probably be spawning. We're gonna have to like leave the area to like, in order to get it. Let's go here, and what area do I have to explore? Ice Peak Arena side, we should go back here. So I think it's exactly what we're gonna do. It's gonna take us longer to get there considering we have the main man Braviari. Can I go wrong with him? Like, look at this, y'all. Look how quick we're just gliding through this area. Hop on him again, it'll give us a nice little uppity, uppity draft. And we'll get moving on. Yes, sir. Run it up. Glalies. We got plenty of them. And we can go over here. We did get a... Oh, wait. I got to add Ruffle to my thing. There's Obama Snow. Do not land. We have to add Ruffle to our, our team. I have to remember to... Definitely have to remember to uh, get Ruffle on the squad. And there's a Babiro down there. And Badoos. What are Badoos and Babiros doing? Get them out of my face. I want to head to this area. Right here. We got any new Pokemon. We got some Rufflets. Dive down the ground here. Got some brand new Ruffies. I gotta add to the squad. Last Pokemon, like I said. Awesome, awesome. And I'll catch more of these guys. Actually, I'll kill. I'll fight a few. I'll fight a few of these. Eight palms up there. I'm just looking for newbies, you know? We got a lot of new Pokemon in today's episode, which is great. A bunch of new ice Pokemon. Loving it. And we got a really cool Pokemon. We got Hisuian Zoru. I forget how you pronounce it, but he's super rare in this area. He only spawns in that cavern. I this whole game. It's really, really cool. We got some Subfoot Root. We got some uh, Grit Gravel, which is good for effort levels later in game for post game let's move on here any more rough what's i can kill catch oh rolls rolls are kind of rare so i'd rather just catch it as many as i can so throw give me that rolls rolls baby sir level 19 they kind of spawn at a low level not too bad what we got over here we got amy palm oh, is that alpha that's got to be alpha right yeah it's alpha. i see size no wonder why routes are spawning more rough foots i don't mind catching more rough foots I forgot a boar sees me. Ruffle, come here. Oh, he saw me. Son of a biscuit. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I'm dipping with Bravey already. Any newbies? Nah, nah, nah. Amy Palm. What is that? Another Ruffle? I kind of want to catch this Ruffle. But we'll see more. We will definitely see more. So let's go here. And there are rocks. Any other area we can experience over here? No, we'll go this way. Hey, send it, baby. Bravey already just cooking. This thing's cooking. The only problem with this thing is you can't go up, which makes sense. It's just used for climbing. You can't go up, but the only way you can go up is just by uh, using him over again like this and grabbing a nice another little up there. Go ride this way. I kind of want to make my way to the top of this mountain. Let me be my best bet. What is that? Is that a medicinal leak? Medicinal leak. Laylee. Other pokies. Little settlement. And something else that's cool that you can do with Braveyard is just fly right into a wall. And then you can hit A and switch right to Steam's when it's on. Super cool. Oh, yo, Hisuian Sneasel. Oh, he saw me. Son of a biscuit. Hisuian Sneasel. We out of here. All right, so we're going to climb to the top of this uh, area right here because there is the final lake. We, we like to explore the lake. There's some new Pokemon and a lot of rough ones fly over. So we did catch an Abra on our way up here. Is that thing like, trying to hit me? Who's, who's trying to hit me? Oh, yo, I need this Abra. Please don't see me. I know you don't see me. Where'd he go? Oh, no, we didn't. Okay, we hit it. Okay, catch it. Catch it. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Call a nice, lovely Abra. 
Bro, they're a pain to catch. So anytime you get a chance to catch them, you should be catching them. Switch back to a bird. Here's some lake, yo. Lovely little lake. I'm just going to fly over it and head to the area over here. Look at this, yo. Beautiful. Because lakes are our post-game areas. They really are. You come back to them post-game, you catch legendaries in them. More Pokemon will spawn around them. But a lot of Rufflets will spawn here. If you look over the water, you're going to see a few Rufflets. All that good stuff. Anything over here that I see. No, no, no. Like I said, the rest of today's video, we're just going to be chilling. Trying to catch some more Pokemon. Trying to get our star rank up a little bit, too. Need some XP. And I want to fill out the Pokedex. So there's a Sneasler. There you have it. Uh, what's down here? I see a Viva Chunk. I don't want I'm a material guy. Land here. Give me this thing. Give me this lovely thing. Fly here. And we can start making our way towards uh, Avalug's Arena, too. Oh, wait. Bomb Snows and Snowbers. I want them both. I want them both. Come here. Come here, boys. Come here. We haven't we caught a bomb of snow earlier, but we haven't caught a, a snowbird yet, which is his first evolution. Let's see. Where's he at? I can't see nothing. Can't nobody tell me nothing. <laughs> they can't tell me nothing. I'm gonna catch these pokies. Hey. That was not a back shot, get out of my face. I just want that snowbird. I don't care about you, Bomber Snow. Run it. Run it. Run it up. I'll fight them both. I'll fight them both. 360. Hold up. I had to finish my 360. It's over. Battle us. Do a double battle with us. Thank you. All right. We're going to take out this bomb still first. I dropped an Ogre. I haven't seen how this move looks. Yet. Honestly, it doesn't, doesn't look that cool. It looks cooler in the other games. It looks cooler in the other games. Not even going to lie. Jeans ain't even going to lie here. He's going to use, he's gonna use Energy Ball. Easy. It's all there. Tasty little snack. And you know what? I'm just gonna. I feel like we kill it if we don't if we hit it. So I'm just gonna throw great balls at it. Let me add you to the decks, baby. Come here, boy. Let me tell you something. Get my Pokedex. Uh, get out of my face. Ice shard coming out here. Bruh. Bruh, 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 bruh. What's in my great ball? Get cooking with it. Hey. Give it to me. Give it to me all day. All day long. Wow. Beautiful. Add server to the decks. And now we're going to head to that ladder. Now I'm pretty sure we caught a, a good chunk of Pokemon in this. Great chunk. And there, actually, there might be a hidden cave down here. Which I would love to go to. Yes, there is. And my, my memory serves me good. Serves me really good. What is that? Okay, there's a rock there. And if you come to these little rocks, you ever see rocks? Thank you for everybody who told me on my YouTube comment section. You can just drop Pokemon. And they'll just tee off all these rocks for me. There we go. We can make our way into the secret hollow. And there's just a... Uh, I don't know if any Pokemon ever spawn here, but there's a uh, few goodies in here. A few goodies for the materials. So Tumble Stone, Iron Chunk, all that. Sometimes Stardust. Just get it all. Just get it all. So let's head up here. And let's go to the Avalug Arena before we do finish off today's video. Yo, solid episode. I wish that space distortion was still here. Because I would have loved to do it before. Any, any newbies, yo? I'm still, still down to catch a few. Still down to catch a few. I wanted that Blissey. I can't believe that Blissey got out of hands. <gasps> oh, I thought that was something rare. It's just a it's just a Stantler, which we, are, which we already have like 50 of them from Area 1. A Beeral. Any newbies? More Babirals. Here's that little hollow thing again. Is this a different one? It's the same one. It's got to be the same one. That's definitely the same one. Badoof. And let's keep moving over here. Let's keep on moving. Let's keep on. Oh, definitely want some stuff. Yo, my choke? Hang out here. The Machoke Hangout section. I want this. I want this. And we're gonna go talk to this guy. And oh, we still have to like, travel up to the top, I believe. I believe we still have to travel up to the top. Foldo's here. He's like, yo, what up, Jeans? How you doing? Why is it if it isn't Jeans? Hello, dude. Well, it's cool, dude. I dig him. I dig him. But, yeah, I'm interested in defeating this little Avalug. I, I shouldn't have said little, because if you guys battle this thing yet, it's like the size of this map. It's huge. It's like it's a menace. It's a menace, but only only I can take it out because I'm the best. But look at this dude. He's swole with no shirt on. What's he doing? What's he doing with no shirt on out in the middle of the cold? He just wants to show off his muscles. That little tool. He's such a tool. Get him out of here. Who shows off their muscles? <laughs> I was just playing with you guys. I was just playing. <laughs> I realized I was saying that. I was like, Gene, you're wearing a cutoff right now. <laughs> And I was just like, I might as well. Might as well make a joke out of it. 
Nothing's better than making fun of yourself, guys. Always remember that. Always remember that. Wise words from Gene. But this is actually the area where we have to go to fight Avlog. Once we walk up there and talk, we will fight him. And that is not what I want to do right now. What I want to do, actually, head back to this camp. Do one thing before we finish off today's video. You guys already know. We're adding the sixth and final mod to the squad. My lovely Ruffle. And how many did we catch? Oh, yo, look, we got some cool Pokemon in the last one. Look at that, yo. Sylveon. Yo, we got some bangers in the last episode. Gibble, Sheldon, Sylveon, Jolteon, Chimecho, Drapion. Ooh, that's a goodie today, too. Look at that. Glalie rolls. We caught a good amount today. Starting off with the snow run. Snow run was first. We got some of these swine ups. This thing's sick. He's sick. Goes to normal. And then we got Ruffling, yo. Ruffling. What, what nature are you? Please be something solid. Oh, attack down, speed up. That ain't too bad. He has physical attacking, but nice little speed. He's timid. He's lovely. He's bad. It's not bad. He is physical attacking, but we're going to throw him on the team. Final Pokemon on the screen. Team, sorry, bit. get out of my face. We don't need you. There it is. All those Pokemon. But, guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know my videos go live. As the next episode, we're going to be taking on the fifth and final noble Pokemon, Avalon. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everybody.